So people nowadays, it's now the, the in vogue thing to say, I'm being censored. When in fact, a lot of people on YouTube are not being censored for what they are saying. So let's cover someone who really is being censored for what they are trying to say. So you may or may or not know, I've talked about her on this channel before, Marie Britt Holmes. She's a former naturopathic doctor who basically now believes that everything she taught and practiced is complete woo-woo and quackery and just not real science. And now she's doing, she did a real medical, uh, real science degree uh, in Germany and now writes about her former experiences as a naturopathic doctor and her experiences at Basar University, one of the top leading uh, naturopathic universities uh, in the US. And the first thing that first happened to her, Basar University decided to go after her. They filed a lawsuit against her to try and stop her. And now, and now, a naturopath who uh, runs the um, the cancer clinic of the US who treats people with a vitamin C infusion baking soda and says that, you know, clearly um, what you need is an all natural diet and you need to cut out sugar completely because sugar um, fuels cancer cells, even though there's no scientific evidence that supports that theory, is also now going to sue her. But why is she going after her? Well, it all starts off with this. Basically, Marie Britt Holmes um, has a website called The Naturopathic Diaries where she writes and talks about her experiences as a naturopathic doctor and why it's quackery. What um, the person who uh, is doing the suing her, was she came to believe that she may have been responsible for domain squatting her name. So uh, Marie Britt Holmes, um, she, you know, she took her name and bought the domain name. So, and basically now when you type in those domain names, it takes you to the uh, Naturopathic uh, Association of America. I wonder why. <laughs> so uh, it's believed, and she believes that she did this when she put this information out on her own website. She's also suing her for uh, missing, because she says uh, that she's misinformed the public about uh, what she's doing. And, when all she's done is commented on the information that this quack has put out there on her own website. So this is another lawsuit that she is going through. So, and what's the attempt? It's to actually censor her. The two main causes of, this, uh, of these two lawsuits that she is facing at the moment are directly designed to take down her website, to have her take down the internet, um, you know, her, her videos that she's been involved with and to basically stop her talking about her her experiences this is someone who was generally riled an industry of an insider who was on the inside and remember she qualified top of her class got a you know a sought after uh, placement so that she could practice as a naturopathic doctor this isn't someone who um was a nobody in, the, in this industry. She was somebody. And now that she's t realized that she what she was practicing was quackery and absolute nonsense, she has every right to say that what these naturopaths are, are preaching is, is nonsense, it's non-scientific, they have no evidence that anything they're saying is working. Uh, she has every right to do so, and she has every right to warn the public about these charlatans. <laughs> So that is a real case of censorship. So if you do want to go and support her, because now she's fighting two lawsuits, um, go and um, go on the Naturopathic Diaries. You'll see her, you know, donation links to help her fight this. This is someone who generally needs help and is generally actually facing real live case of you know censorship on the internet. So go and support someone who actually is being censored.